In this video, we will learn about addition to 5 and subtraction from 5. Do you know what partners are? It is when you and a friend work together. The two of you are called partners. Here are some pictures of partners. When two numbers work together to make a new number, the two numbers are called partners. 2 and 3 are partners of 5 because they go together to make 5. Just as partners who work together can switch places, number partners can switch places. We can say 2 and 3 are partners of 5. Or we can say 3 and 2 are partners of 5. We can also say that 5 has partners 2 and 3. Or that 5 has partners 3 and 2. So as you can see, it does not matter which partner comes first. In this video, we will learn to combine partners to make the number 5. Combine means to put the two partners together to make 5. We will use a white 5 pattern as a puzzle to fill with our partners. This helps us see how the partners work together to make 5. Let's put the number 4 in our puzzle. What partner goes with 4 to make 5? 1. 4 and 1 are partners of 5 because they go together to make 5. We can switch the partners and put the 1 in the puzzle first and see that we need 4 to make 5 because 1 and 4 are partners of 5. What number do you think is 3's partner to make 5? That's it, 2. 3 and 2 are partners of 5. Let's switch the partners and put the 2 in our puzzle first. We can see that 2 needs 3 to make 5. Our last partners to make 5 are sort of tricky. That's because one of the partners is 0. 0 means nothing. Let's put the number 5 in our puzzle. See, 5 needs 0 to make 5 because 5 and 0 are partners of 5. And if we switch the partners and put 0 in our puzzle first, which means nothing, we can see that we still need 5 to make 5. Now let's play a missing partner game. I'll show you the first partner, and you tell me what partner it needs to make 5. What does 3 need? That's it, 2. 3 and 2 are partners of 5, and we can see the 5 pattern. Here are our tricky partners. What partner does 5 need to make 5? Did you say 0? You're getting it. 5 and 0 are partners of 5. If we have 1, how many do we need to make 5? That's it, 4. 1 and 4 make 5. How many does 2 need to make 5? Did you say 3? That's it, 2 and 3 are partners of 5. What does 4 need to make 5? One. 4 and 1 make 5. What does 0 need to make 5? 5. 0 and 5 are partners of 5. How many cats do you see? Do you see 4? How many more make 5? 1 more. 4 and 1 make 5. How many ducks do you see? How many more make five? 
Did you say to, you're good at this? How many footballs do you see? How many more make five? That's it, zero. How many blocks do you see? How many more make five? Four, because one and four are partners of five. Now how many blocks? And how many do we need to make five? Three, because two and three make five. How many blocks do you see now? Do you see zero? And we need all five, because zero and five are partners of five. Another thing we can do with partners is separate them. This means we take one of the partners away, and then the other partner is left. It does not matter which partner we take away first, the other partner will be left. When we take one of our number partners away, the other partner is left. Five, take away partner one, leaves partner four. It does not matter which partner we take away first. We can take the four away, and one is left. Here are five cubes in a five carton. If I take out four cubes, how many cubes will be left in the carton? Did you say one? Nice job! You know that four and one are partners of five. If I take one cube out of my carton, how many will be left? Four. That's it. Here are five blocks in my five carton. If I take out five blocks, how many will be left? Zero. If I have five blocks and I take out zero, how many will be left? Five, because zero and five are partners of five. Here are five triangles in a five carton. If I take out three, how many will be left? Two, that's it, you're doing great. What if I have five and I take out two? Three are left. Let's practice taking one partner away and see how many are left. What if we have five and we take away four? One is left. If we have five and take away two, how many will be left? Three. Five take away five leaves zero. Five take away one leaves four. You can do this one. Five take away three. leaves two. Five take away zero leaves five. Here are five blocks. If I take three away, how many will be left? Did you say two? You know that because two and three are partners of five. If I have five and I take five away, zero are left. Five and zero are partners of five. If I have five and I take zero away, how many are left? Five. Five take away four leaves how many? Did you say one? Way to go. 
because 4 and 1 are partners of 5. You know all the ways to combine the partners to make 5. Let's review. 5 and 0 are partners of 5. And we can switch the partners and say 0 and 5 are partners of 5. 4 and 1 make 5. Or 1 and 4 make 5. It does not matter which partner comes first. 3 and 2 are partners of 5. And we can say 2 and 3 are partners of 5. Let's review separating the partners of 5. 5 take away 5 leaves the partner 0. And we can switch the partners. 5 take away 0 leaves 5. 5 take away partner 4 leaves partner 1. Switch the partners. 5 take away 1 leaves 4. 5 take away 3 leaves 2. And 5 take away 2 leaves 3. You know all the ways to combine the partners to make 5. And you also know the ways to separate the partners from 5. Congratulations!